Hi viewers, today I am going to cook Haryali chicken which can also be called green chicken. So to make this recipe let's see the ingredients involved. So uh, firstly we require uh, mint, half, half a bunch of mint, half a bunch of cilantro, 3 to 4 green chilies and few strands of curry leaves. We might require uh, roughly chopped onions, a pinch of kasuri methi, a cup of yogurt, a cup of dry coconut, this, uh, sorry this is a uh, dry coconut which is made it into paste and uh, half a cup of uh, poppy seeds which is made into paste. So firstly we are going to take a pan, add some oil, so once the oil is hot enough have been frying for around one minute now. Once the onions are like, translucent, remove it in the bowl and allow it to cool down. I'm now going to make a paste of all these fried onions and the mint, cilantro and green chilies, curry leaves. Everything will be blended along with yogurt. So the chicken the main ingredient is ready now so I'm ready with the green masala which is the blend of all the green leaves all the curry leaves cilantro and green chilies and uh, mint leaves along with uh, half a cup of yogurt and fried onions so now we are going to cook this masala along with the chicken by adding some more spices I'm going to take the use the same pan for cooking I'm going to fry the onions in the oil so apart from the uh, previously mentioned spices we might require a tablespoon of coriander a half a half a teaspoon of uh, cumin powder and uh, one uh, half a teaspoon of pepper powder black pepper powder and of course ginger garlic paste which is the main spice in here. I'm gonna add going to add around three good spoons of ginger garlic paste As you can see, onions and ginger garlic paste has been fried properly for around one minute now. To this, I'm going to add one tablespoon, one heap full of coriander powder and half a tablespoon of cumin powder. All the contents thoroughly. Now add coconut paste, poppy seeds paste, Now I'm going 
टमाटर एड कसूरी में थे ड्राई फेनेग्रिक लीव एंड एड द रिमेनिंग यूगर is cooked it looks very thick and you can see little oil oozing out from the edges at this point we have to add the chicken mix the chicken coat the entire gravy all the pieces of the chicken and allow it to cook simmer the stuff allow it to cook for another 15 to 20 minutes if you are going to pressure cook further then cook, uh, just keep it for another for one whistle or so once the, uh, all the uh, chicken pieces are coated thoroughly i'm going to add garam masala this is the last ingredient but i forgot to mention it at the beginning here goes my garam masala just two pinches of it not much mix it thoroughly cover and cook for another half an hour this is how the chicken is after cooking i pressure cooked it for around 15 minutes the oil is also separated this is how it looks once done so thanks for watching my video if you like my recipe please give a like on facebook and subscribe my channel